All right, everyone, welcome back to Vault Hunters. I'm doing this video directly after the last one just because I'm in the mood for some vaults, but let's go right now. We're going in right now. Let's also get some afterlife on this guy right here. I want to make a wither skeleton farm at some point just so I can get infinite soul flames because that would be kind of nice. Another plentiful. Unlucky, though. That kind of sucks. Whoa. Okay, plentiful is always nice, though, because then we get stuff like this, and I need all of the ores that I can get right now. Especially Eupoline. I'm hoping for Eupoline this time. Also, I forgot to mark my portal like the dummy. Oh, I did not mean to do that. What did I do? Uh, I pressed the K button. I need to stop taking damage, actually, too. I need I need that new chest plate. Which I don't think I actually rolled at the end of the last video. I completely forgot. Again, I'm so sorry. I kind of left you at a cliffhanger there. I completely forgot about that. But we'll roll that at the end of this video. Water level, I don't know if I want to be part of this. I don't think I do, so I'm just going to go this way. Oh, well, the game wants me to be part of it. I'm also super excited for Windcraft, by the way. Um, I mentioned in the last video that I'm going to be doing the Windcraft 2.0 update when that comes out. A lot of you guys didn't know what I was talking about, or at least a few of you. Um, I explained it in the comments, but basically Windcraft is an MMORPG server that um, is getting an update this month, this month being September of 2022. If you're watching this in the future, it's probably already out, but but yeah, so I'm excited for that. I'm going to be playing that a lot when that comes out, probably more than this Vault Hunter series, because I want to play that too. So, and we've been playing the Vault Hunters a lot recently, so I want to give- oh no, I did not mean to do that. Beniotite. I'm getting a lot of like blocks now, like the compressed blocks, which is really good. Uh, lots of good stuff here. Uh, no Eupoline, unfortunately. More Wudodai, though. Wudai is always nice, because that allows me to create, um, what does that allow me to do? It allows me to do good stuff, I can't remember. Um, but this isn't even the best part of the room. You get to go down here, and then you get to see everything past here. Like, nothing, apparently. Like this. Um, what is that? Wudai? Nice. I feel like ores are actually better than chests, like they feel more satisfying. Let me know down in the comments, what do you guys think is more satisfying, ores or chests? It's very close for me. Laramar, thank you. Painite, thank you. Ancient Debris, which I still don't know what to do with. More Laramar. I'm getting so much Laramar too. And last waterfall, I think. Beniotite. And Laramar. Nice. Cool, okay. Let's go back now. Oh wait, I forgot there's ores in these trees too. I just almost passed up a Puffium. It's also only been six minutes somehow. It feels like it's been way longer. Okay, let's go this way. Away from my portal. What room is this? Oh! Oh, but I have unlucky on this vault. Oh, no. Okay, well, that's still... It's still worth coming here. Absolutely still worth it. Okay, memorize the pattern, everyone. Nice. Nice, no explosions. Cool, cool, cool. That went very well. Now there is still more to this room. I think I got this room on the first 100 days of this series, so this room is actually quite good because there's a lot of guild chests. But as I mentioned before, it is unlucky, so... Okay, that could have been really bad immediately. There's a create cog wheel there. Okay, let's try and get as many gilded chests as we can here. Um, I'm gonna build up away from these guys. I don't want to deal with them right now. My reach is actually really coming in handy. I said before that I want to get rid of my reach. I don't think I want to now, because this is actually really helping. Ooh, they are going to be a problem to deal with if I want to go down there. Let's go like here. Okay, I think it's time we leave this room. That was a very good room, but yeah, I already alluded to that. That's fine. Okay, cool. How many soul shards do I have? 369. I can actually gamble one. I might do that at the end of this. Speaking of which, what's the soul shard? Oh, I can't open it during the vault. I want to see what the soul shard shop had. What is this? 10 hearts? I'm fine with doing that. That's cool. Nothing great there. No favor either. So for an unlucky vault, I'm. this is going pretty well. I wish it wasn't unlucky for that uh, gilded room though. That would have been really good. I'm also trying not to use as many potions. I'm just using my dash to refill my energy. Or to refill my health. I don't know why I said energy. Dude, this heal ability on the dash is so good. Let's go this way. I need to keep track of where my thing is. There's only 200 blocks away, that's fine. 
Still got 12 minutes left. Haven't found a single obelisk, surprisingly. It's kind of worrying, honestly. Oh, there we go, okay. It's the first one. I'm pretty sure there's always 10 in a vault. So having only found like one is kind of weird. I do want to fight the boss in this vault if possible. Although I don't think that's going to be the case. I need to always keep from forgetting about Ron Flesh, but I do need it. Let's go this way. I am not keeping track of which rooms I'm going to, by the way. I'm kind of just running in a circle. I'm also almost out of space. I'm going to go down deeper into this room just to see what it has to offer me. Nothing, apparently. What, what vault are we in? Plentiful. Uh, ooh, what's this? Two minutes, I'll take it. Nothing great, okay, well... I want favors from these guys. I don't care about the loot inside. Let's go... Oh, I was already here. I just doubled back on myself. I didn't realize I did that. Let's keep going towards my portal. Let's hopefully find something good. It's a graveyard. I don't really like graveyards too much. Because they're kind of... Oh, there's another thing here. Um, this is actually kind of a nice room to fight the boss in. So I'm gonna mark two waypoints there just so I know where I'm going. Um, ten hearts, I will take that. No favor? Are you kidding? Wild West room? No obelisk, though. I still have six minutes, but that time creeps up on you later on. It would be nice if that obelisk decided to show up now. Five minutes left. This is not looking that great. Oh, there it is. Okay, cool. Oh, and this is a water room. Okay, let's do this. Here. Let's go back to the other room and activate that obelisk, and then we'll come back to this one. Because this one's actually a better room to fight the boss in. How's my chest plate looking? Not great. Very, very low. I could just repair core it. I, it has three repairs. Oh! I almost passed by this chest. Wow. Okay, well I'm glad I didn't. Also, I have like no time left. I need to go now. Also, back to full health without using a single potion. This dash ability is so good. I've said it so many times, but it's so good. Wait, I've been in this room. I've been to this room and I didn't even activate the obelisk. Are you kidding? Oh wait, I'm... My brain is not working today. <laughs> I've been to this room, he says. I'm sorry, it's early in the morning, my brain isn't working. It is time for the boss fight now. I have a new ability with my ghost walk. I need to have a keybind set to activate all of my abilities at once, just so I can dominate this boss. All right, so we have three minutes left. That should be plenty of time. Why is, he's not taking damage again. Again, I don't know if that's a bug or if that's like, yeah, see like now he's taking damage. Once my shaman wears off, he starts taking damage. I think that's it. Hold on. Yeah, once my shaman wears off, he starts taking damage. That is really interesting. I mean, I'm glad I figured it out now. So now we know what's going on. Okay, so these two are what we got from that uh, from that vault. That's really, really good. Um, let's actually really quickly take off all our stuff. Okay, now let's open a bunch of our stuff. Look at this. So much loot. Okay, so we got a lot more stuff that time. Look at all this. Tank. Another Thorns damage one, okay, great. More idols, which I do actually need because my idol is actually about to run out. I need these chest plates too. But also, lots of ores that time too. Still no Eupoline, unfortunately. Got plenty of skill. I think we're done with Star Essence in order to get Danks. We have enough Laramar, especially with that. We just need eight more Vault Diamonds and then we'll be good. I could use a Repair Core on my chest plate if I wanted to. I don't know if I do want to though. One more Vault Diamond, we need seven more, and then we'll be good. Seven more till Danks, that's crazy. Also, I just realized we're level 35. We went up so many levels from that. Okay, and now, what we got in our boss crate. Okay, once again, I forgot to use my Eternal. Uh, but a Catalyst, Nether Star, Gifter, two Escalium. I wish I got Eupoline, though. Unidentified Vault Axe, that's not bad. Could have been better, but definitely not bad. Oh, wait, that Catalyst is awful. <laughs> Hold on. That's really, really bad. Um, extended Hard, I don't really like that either. Random Negative and this one. We'll actually re-roll these. Uh, it's Perfect Alexandrite to re-roll. Let's re-roll actually after I put away my stuff, but I want to re-roll that. Okay, and now we need our Perfect Alexandrite to re-roll this. So we'll grab our Alexandrite, put it here, and re-roll, please. Lucky and Positive and Negative. That's actually a really good one. That's very good, actually. I'm pretty happy with that. That's... Wow. Okay. But now it's time to open a bunch of our stuff, right? So we'll start with the traders. We got nine. That's pretty good. Let me pull up the old YouTube really quick so I can grab some of my subs. Okay, there's one. Okay, your name won't fit, sorry, but... 
cool. Those are those three. There we go. Ooh, I like your skin. It's pretty cool. There we go. Also like your skin. Your guys' skins are so cool. I might be repeating some people, but I think I'm not. I'm just- I ran out of people that have publicly subscribed to me. So I'm just going through the comments and I'm putting up people that have commented because I appreciate you guys. Yeah, I'm actually definitely repeating people because I recognize some of you guys, but you know what? It doesn't really matter. I don't care. Those of you who have been supporting me for a while, I appreciate it. And I am repeating you guys because I want to show my support to you. So there we go. That's that. Now we have this to open all of our Relic Booster Packs, which is so satisfying, by the way. It's so nice. Not a single thing either. No Pickerang still. Oh, come on. We got a Power Bar back, which is nice. All right, CWG is still pulling his weight very, very slowly, but he's doing a good job. I appreciate it. All right, now it's time for some good stuff because now we're going to be opening a bunch of our scrappy stuff here. Let's open our scrappy stuff first, which probably isn't going to be that great. That one's actually not bad. It has one level. Yeah, this could be a decent replacement, actually. Bad, 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 bad. What are our boots looking like? Yeah. This is actually a pretty decent replacement that I can put down here. Okay, next up we have our Scrappy Plus stuff, which is most of what we have here. Ooh, plus one reach. What's my chest plate looking like? Six armor though. I'm gonna actually keep this one around, just in case. I know the armor is kind of bad, but it is kind of nice to keep around for a little bit. We'll see how that goes. Next we have our common stuff, which is only two things actually. Uh, not bad. That's actually pretty decent. 500 durability, not great. And my my sword actually does more damage than that axe does. So yeah, it's not too bad, not too great. Yeah, we also have two skill points. I don't know what I'm saving up for. At least I can't remember what I'm saving up for. We have maxed out on speed and strength right now. Uh, when my next, next strength level is at level 40, I'm level 35. So let's save actually for strength really quick. So on five levels, it's gonna cost three, so I can spend four. I can spend these two that I have now. I can go another vein miner. You don't want to do that. Another vein miner, four out of five. Okay, and with that, that's the end of this video. I know these are kind of short and I'm just doing like one vault per video, but like I said before, I don't really have a lot of time to make these videos, so I hope it's at least a little bit entertaining. But other than that, I'll see you all in the next one. Goodbye.